Hi everyone, my name's Louisa Bullivan and I am the Voluntary Services Manager for Cambridgeshire and Peterborough NHS Foundation Trust, which I will refer to as CPFT throughout the rest of the presentation. I'm going to start by introducing our team and then I'll move on to give you an idea of the services provided by CPFT and a glimpse of what volunteering for us looks like. So here's the team which consists of myself to the left, Louisa Bullivant, and to my right, Emma Judd. Between us both, we manage all aspects of recruitment and onboarding for vo of volunteers for all services provided by CPFT. So I'm now going to talk to you about CPFT to try and give you an idea about the types of services that we provide. So CPFT is a health and social care organisation providing integrated older adult physical and mental health services, adult mental health and learning disability services and children's mental health services across Cambridgeshire and Peterborough and children's community health services in Peterborough. We are dedicated to providing high quality care with compassion to improve the health and well-being of the people we care for, our staff, volunteers and members to support and empower them to lead a fulfilling life. And across the region, we support a population of just under a million people, employing around 4,200 NHS staff. So within the 4,200 staff is a range of disciplines, from staff nurses to healthcare assistants, psychologists, psychiatrists, occupational therapists, corporate functions such as communications, and we also have a research and development team. All of our workforce, including volunteers, sign up to our values, which I've popped at the bottom there. So P-R-I-D-E, which of course spells pride, and underneath you can see what each of those letters resembles. So CPFT's voluntary services, who are we and how do we embed ourselves into, the, into CPFT? So the team, we provide dedicated support to CPFT and the trust charity Head to Toe. And our volunteers fa facilitate the vital gift of time, energy and resource from the community. The voluntary services team have been at the heart of CPFT's COVID-19 response, providing roles and opportunities across all areas of the NHS, from administration and delivery roles to placement on wards. And Emma and I, we work with every service to ensure a wide and diverse range of opportunities for you as volunteers to get involved in. And Emma and I, as well as the rest of the Trust, understand that you as volunteers play a vital role in supporting the services, staff and patients. So what do we do? As a team, we enhance CPFT's ability to go above and beyond for the wider community. We support patient and staff wellbeing. We enable people who access our services to improve their mental and physical health through volunteering and we provide a unique opportunity to help services with additional resources. And you'll see there I've popped a couple of pictures in. In the middle you've got lovely Isla, one of our pets as therapy pooches. Bottom left is Randall who has been delivering PPE across the services to all teams. On the right is an example of how we support staff well-being. So a group of volunteers there that came together to put together well-being packages for our staff. And at the top right is Jeanette, who helped with the COVID-19 vaccinations. So I've listed just a few ideas uh, and examples of roles available within the, the Trust. During the pandemic, we have seen a change to the types of roles available and how they can be fulfilled. So we are finding that there is a broader range of opportunities to get involved in. So there's more ad hoc roles such as driving support roles. And one of the pictures there is of Keith, who's holding some Krispy Kremes and Keith helped deliver those out to all the teams across the trust. 
a good example of those ad hoc roles. Another example is we have volunteers that are helping NRS Healthcare, an external company who provide equipment such as walking frames and seat pads to our communities. We also have been asked to help support in gaining vital patient feedback for our district nursing teams in Cambridge. Our volunteers who have supported this role have been fundamental to the service development and change, which has had a direct impact on our patients and their experience of using this service. You'll also see there a team that's called Dementia Carers Support Service or DCSS. DCSS support carers of the patients that access our services and who have been diagnosed with dementia. This team have very few staff, with the vast majority of workforce being volunteers. Volunteers who offer their invaluable time and experiences of caring for loved ones with dementia. I've popped in um, just a couple of examples of feedback that we've received from volunteers. We are really proud of our volunteers and all that they do and achieve. Our flexible approach and unique recruitment process is testament to providing an individualised journey. We recognise not everyone embarks on their volunteering journey for the same reasons. We are here to listen to you and Emma and I adopt a very friendly approach to your journey. We want you to have the best possible experience. I've listed here ways in which that you can get in touch with us if you'd like to get involved. So on the right hand side is an example of what our web page looks like. And on the left, you have the details to access our website, which is www.cpft.nhs.uk. Or you can contact us by email, volunteers.cpft at cpft.nhs.uk. And please do follow us on Twitter and Facebook for updates with regard to our volunteering activities. I thank you for listening and I really look forward to hearing from you. Thank you.